Yeah. So Ottomans might not have to back down. I wonder if that takes into account all of uh, Prussia's spheres. I doubt it. What it did. Oh. Oh, it might. Can't wait until one day I'm on the Great Powers list. I'm only <laughs> 70 points away right now. Wow, that's great. I'm at 27 points. The oh, did you declare it? Uh, not yet. Were you ready? Uh, yeah, go ahead and declare. Okay. <laughs> I should have just declared to begin with because... Yeah, I forgot. Hopefully you didn't <laughs> lose the thing. No, I didn't. There you go. I'm at war. And I think I called you in. I don't know. This Luxembourg is kind of needy. <laughs> Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> My savior. Fight our war for me. You say, you've saved me. You just wait until I'll be giving you loans. <laughs> oh, Scandinavia joined the Ottomans. So oh, good. Okay. Good. So it's a pretty even fight. And Austria hasn't decided. But... Austria will probably go France, though, because they hate be. Ottomans. Yeah. And that's why they're not allied. Because they absolutely hate the Ottomans. Let me know if you see um, Netherlands White Peace. Okay, I'll pay attention to the war screen. Yeah, literally the war score for them hasn't gone up at all. Yeah, it's been at 2.9 for like a little while. So what do I do now with my uh, my super cool Chinese province? <laughs> I can build so many it's units. Militaries, yeah. You just focus military. I'm building a crap ton of engineers now that I can actually build them. Hey, I can build. Oh, we're about to have ourselves a first world war. Nice. And we don't have to participate, and we don't get any shit for not being in we it. We just get to watch. And maybe pick on whoever loses the worst. Exactly, yeah. France gets blown over here. I hope so. Prussia's going to want access through my country. Because we all know they're not going to be able to walk <sighs> around it. Right. How are we doing on Johor? Uh, you're at 50. 51. They don't have any troops, so whatever you siege. Aww. Oh, Albania's going to get all of its states. I wanted to see war, damn it. Yeah. Ten years in and we haven't had a major European conflict yet. Yeah, come on, like Austria or somebody. I think Austria's too, or like Prussia's too afraid of the um, of them for some reason. I don't know why. They're not that much bigger. Oh, I just clicked Russia. They're and not like, that much bigger. Yeah. Prussia has better too. spheres. Oh, yeah. So they should be able to easily win. Are we not allies with the Prussia anywhere? Um, Whoops. I, I never was. You aren't. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Let me re-offer that. Let me find an ally. Oh, yeah. Maybe Russia. Maybe Scandinavia would be a good ally. Oh, yeah, or Scandinavia. Because they'll border. Yeah, yeah, Russia hates us. Oh, do they? Yeah, like a lot. <laughs> How can you tell? Oh, <laughs> relations. Yeah, it's like minus 172. Oh, he kind of likes me. Should France go, keeps oh, dropping yeah. our relations. France does? Yeah. I have 116. Soon enough. Man, they really need to peace out of this war. What if we literally sat here for the rest of the game waiting for them to peace out of this war? I mean, eventually, we're just going to be at war with the Netherlands anyways, so... I mean, they will peace out eventually. They will white peace because it's at uh, the war score is not nothing. So eventually, uh, they'll get fed up and be like, "Okay, fine, white peace." And they'll say it like that, all uh, dejected and upset. When I was in, um, <coughs> what was I at? I was in Yeeps, which is like one of the major World War One battlefields, and uh, 
we walked out of this, or I by myself, you know, just walked out of this museum into the city square. And this guy comes right up into my face and he starts speaking Dutch. And I just, I just shook my head and put my hands up and he was like, oh, you're, you speak English. And I was like, yes. And I was, and I was like, oh, sorry. Uh, just don't hurt me, please. So like, I never thought it'd be so strange as it was just going to another country and like having no one around you speak English whatsoever. It was so nice when we got back into the airport into London and it was like, oh my gosh, everyone's speaking English. <laughs> I can imagine that's just be like really horrifying. Like, you like you hear people say that like the French don't like to speak English and it's definitely true. They, yeah, they can speak English. They just won't speak it to you. They won't. And they'll shake their head at you and you're just like, I'm sorry. Actually, the only time I ever had someone speak English to me nicely was when I bought my my little Napoleon figurine. He's like, ah, oh, he appreciates our heroes. Yeah. And it was probably because, like, the day before these girls on my trip, they went in and it's, like, one of the signs in French said, don't touch. It's all these, like, figurines. If you, you know, they fall off and they break. And so the next day I went in and I, I asked him to come over and grab it for me so I didn't have to touch it. And then he spoke English to me the whole time. And I was like, nice. Yep. Are we still working on Johor? Uh, we're at 67%. There I haven't good. looked to yeah, see They, they only have two provinces there. left. Okay. I'm kind of half paying attention because I'm going around building up, you know, railroads and stuff. Okay. Yeah, you know, you, you do what you need to do over there. I'm just... I still only have 27 points. I guess they're going to offer me peace anyways. Johor? Yeah. Hmm. Right, aren't I the war leader? Oh, yeah. Yeah, you'll, you'll be the one that's notified. You'll probably be the war leader for a very long time. I, I wish, like, that's the other thing I don't really like about Victoria too much, is that it doesn't, it's not very clear how things are calculated or work at all. Oh, yeah, it's so, like, you can tell that. It's very ambiguous. Yes. Oh, yeah, more coal production. Do I even have coal? I have iron. I wonder what your war subsidies are now. Ooh, two ducats a day. Two ducats a day. Here you oh, go. Wait. That's like another 20% income. <laughs> wait, how much? Oh, yeah. I'm still making money, but it won't show me how I'm making it. Hmm. There should be a diplomatic, I think, uh, income underneath or right above subsidies, which might be where my subsidies are showing. Yeah, it's showing up there, but like I have an income of 25 with your your subsidy, it's 26 and I have an expense of 35. So I should be losing nine a month or nine a day, mm -hmm. but I have a plus. Nine. Oh, it doesn't count tariffs. OK, so I'm making 19 from tariffs, 20 from tariffs. That yeah, I mean, that's another thing. It's like it's one the com the the economy in this game is so confusing and hard to get right. But and then on, on top of that, it doesn't even display correctly what you're making. Yeah, like you. Uh, uh, and the worst, so much. The worst part is that like everybody who watches my channel loves Victoria too. I don't know why. I I mean like I like playing it just as much as the next person, but I mean sometimes it gets a little bit much. Yeah, I mean there's only really so much. You know, you you play for the great powers, and you're like, okay, yeah, I probably probably played them all. Yeah, I mean, and like Luxembourg, there's not really anything you can do besides sit around. But I'm providing superior entertainment. I'm scrolling around the screen. I'm zooming in on things. Ooh, check out Jahor. Oh, did you get it fully sieged? Oh. Wait, is that my color? Yeah, that's your gold. That's mine. It's the same color as Ach-J, so I was confused. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I gave it to Ash. They're my new protege. Yeah, I was like, wait, what? <laughs> Are you going to build railroads and stuff there? Or sure. I actually spend some of my money. Oh, don't. No, no, no. <laughs> Please. Uh, your sugar daddy's got you. Yeah, I was going to say, uh, that would be all of my income for the next 10 years to build there you it go. in one province. There's your railroads, son. Okay, so can I build? I can only build two forts. I could probably use a naval base over here. I'll build one. Although, I won't be able to. 
because I'm so far on the list that I won't get anything that I need. <laughs> yeah, and you're not in my sphere anymore, so I can't really, like, you know, oh, foster wants, your yeah. economic growth. I'll decline. I remember to colonize Canada this time. You did? Yeah. Oh, yeah a little bit. Right I got off. a little bit more. I'm sure U.S. is going to enjoy Wow. I bet if I gave access to the Dutch and the Russians, they'd probably just white peace. Mm, probably. It's funny when you look at those provinces you gave up that most of them are like below a thousand population. Yep. It was only... <clears throat> oh, yeah. And then also Seven. the Seven. caribou. Don't forget about the, the timber that I lost. <laughs> My poor timber. That gold boosted my economy by like 150 percent. I have you back in my sphere. Oh, you do? Yep. Yes. I can make forts in three provinces. You're all you're now safe from Prussia. <sighs> Prussia keeps decreasing our relations. Because <laughs> like I keep looking back at them and they're always lower. But you know who doesn't do that? Scandinavia. Scandinavia is a good a good friend. Yeah, Russia didn't want to be my ally. Maybe Austria would be an ally to me. They'd be good for fighting, like, Prussia. Yeah, I think they still have a bigger army. Prussia's uh, allied to the Ottomans now, so... Oh. I, I bet you they're ready to... They're, like, trying to eat up Austria now. Yep. I've never seen Scandinavia form so quickly. I haven't either. Like, maybe, like, close to the 20th century mark, but... 10 years into the game? Probably not. Like, do they just have to go to war with Denmark? Um, they have to become a great power. Which okay. is probably why they gave up Finland, because that gives you a little bit of prestige. Um, and then they also have to... I think they already start out fearing... or No, they already own Norway. Um, but then, yes, they all they got to do is fear Denmark. Yeah. But they have to do it before Denmark... Um, loses uh Schleswig Holstein to Germany. So it's like a really like they had to fight pretty quickly because the Germany Northern German Confederation and Scandinavia share requirements. Ah, yes. So they'll have to go to war. Yeah, so if Prussia wants to do North German, they have to go to war with Scandinavia and they also have to take you into their sphere. So yeah, Scandinavia would be a good ally, although they have half the military of as, yeah, on oh, Austria too. Yeah, France hates me. Okay, <laughs> I was like, maybe Fra maybe France. Hey, France. Hey, I'm gonna try to get Burma into my sphere so I can walk through them to go kill China. That means I could probably uh, fabricate some claims against Stol Siam, huh? Mm-hmm. Is rubber? Wait, not rubber tropical wood any good i know it's like luxury but i mean it's not bad how much i'm at 14 oh for five yes please are you willing to go to fight siam for me yeah okay it's, it's five infamy if i get caught Okay. Are you going to take uh, Bangkok? Can you uh, take Bangkok? No, you can't take Bangkok. No, is that their capital? Yeah. Yeah. So you'd have to take... Uh, I'd probably Rash just connect it. Shamia. Oh, I could... Oh, you could take Yamalaya. But that's yeah. only one province. Or two uh, provinces. Two. Yeah, two. Uh, it, it might not be worth it. Yeah, it's tropical wood. You might want to try taking uh, their inner province here. the uh, This one. Um... Rakshami, because that's a lot, and it's got tea and fruit and stuff. So you, yeah, mm -hmm. it'll open up other things. Yeah, and it. you can stop importing fruit then. No, now I'm importing chairs. <laughs> nice. Furniture, clothes, and liquor. Just, just what us <laughs> Luxembourgers want. Mm -mm. Basic needs. All the basic food groups. Yeah. <laughs> Man, these people will not white peace. No, I was just looking at the same thing. <laughs> just just peace out, please. God damn it. Come on. 
they must know. They must know. They're like, oh, that damn, that damn UK. <laughs> they're just they're just propping them up over there. At least you can walk through uh, them now. I can. Well, I mean, you can walk through Belgium's land. I still have to get through freaking Hanover. They should give me access now. Do you want to, um... It, it really sucks the way that... Because Netherlands is allied with Russia and Spain. And in the sphere of France. It's like, yeah, how could it, you get in a better position than them? That's an insane... Like, that's of, ultimate. Yeah, like, how could you be better protected than Netherlands right now? Which is why I don't want to... Because they're going to instantly eat up the north section of uh, Belgium... Which sucks, because I want to give you the, the port there. So you can at least, you know, somewhat access your capital. Be able to move the yeah. six troops that I have over there. Yeah. Yeah, like, I was even thinking if we even justified a, a war against them, would it change anything? Um, are you ready to go to war with Siam? You have troops yeah. there, I see. Okay. Um, if I declare war, four, that's five, four, yeah, that Rosh Shishima one is the most. Okay. You only need 16 war score. Okay. Go fetch. Thank you. All right, so I'll go crush their 15 stack. Oh, they're sieging one of my provinces. No, kill him. Get off. Oh, I'm going to go to their capital. Okay. Oh, ooh, another. Oh, good. Another Come crisis. on, let's go to war. And we're still we're still spared. Who's back in who? I think uh, probably well, France for Scandinavia. And Austria doesn't have anyone and Prussia hasn't decided. Ooh, so anyone. Austria's I think uh, yeah, Austria's going to go France. Then Prussia's probably going to go Ottomans, uh, right? Cuz they're allied. Yeah. They have to. And then Scandinavia is going to go France. Okay. Which isn't... Uh, that is kind of good for us. We could go to war with Prussia if that were to happen. Prussia went Ottomans. Okay, that wasn't a surprise. You know, the funny thing was about your the war against Johor was I didn't get a notification that you made peace. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> it oh, you don't, it doesn't, you don't care. Congratulations, you have land. We didn't let you know. You don't need to know. <laughs> That one province was 12 war score. Nice. Well, that's their capital, so. Do you have all engineers over here now? Hmm? Over in Siam? No, those are just infantry. Oh. Uh. I just am OP. <laughs> <laughs> all my engineers are in China. Oh, the, in the new sense. province there. Yeah. Because I'm just, like I said, I'm lazy. I just hit the button to make more of everything. For the love. Just make peace over there already. I know, right? You're like, I want my iron and coal, <laughs> damn it. I don't know. I mean, whatever. If it keeps them busy. <laughs> Yeah, like, they probably won't go into another war now, right? Just... What's their war exhaustion? Does like, that'll show? keep... Uh, yeah, it says they're at 100. <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, is I bet, I think Russia is the, the war leader, and Russia don't care. <laughs> Russia's just like, well, fine, we'll sit here as long as yeah. you want. <laughs> they got their, they, like, arms crossed. The next time they, they ask me for access, I'll get... Oh, oh they gave up Macedonia now, too? Ottomans. We need to go be allies with Greece. I'm searing. I've seared them. Oh, yeah. That'll be good. Well, they, they, they're not great. But they have a lot more land than they normally do. Mm-hmm. They're allied with Albania. <laughs> Strong ally. <laughs> yep. They'll be fine. I guess they, they rejected my alliance. I tried they to send did? Greece. Yeah, they rejected it. <laughs> I was going to say, they should be allied with you if you haven't offered one yet. But yeah, they, they don't want one. They rejected it. 
It was probably because you're in three wars at once. Oh yeah, that's probably why. I was wondering why like no one wanted to be. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, I didn't even think about that either when I was offering all the other great powers, allies, or alliances. How's your uh, war score over here? Ooh, an alliance over from Austria. Ooh. Proceed, good yeah, sir. Yeah, I was gonna say that would be interesting. <laughs> and then they can go get their. They can go get like into some war, and we'll just be like, be gone. <laughs> no. <laughs> All right, I'm Have gonna let dying. Russia through just to see if that changes anything. Okay. Not that it actually will change anything, but maybe that will change the AI's thinking of whether or not they can actually win this war. I've had it where uh, once I reloaded, the AI immediately offered peace. Ah, uh, yep. All right. You ready to get your thing? Over here, too? Did you already peace out? Oh, no. No. Yet. Do you want to add another one? Just while you have the infamy limit? Uh... The war's not going well enough. You're going to have to take more land. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get right on that. Because <laughs> uh, I think I want to take Chiang Mai. Yeah, I'll help you out with that. Thank you. Wait, is, is that the next province? Oh, wow. Have you looked to see what China's doing around your little area over here? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. They got the little uh, Iron Curtain set up. <laughs> Literally 30,000 in every province <laughs> next to you. And they, I bet you if you could see one more province, it's probably just 30, 30, 30, 30. <laughs> like, <laughs> all around there. All 500,000 we have right next to your little area. Yeah, and they're only 10% civilized, so... Uh, once once the truce is over with them, then I'll go back to war with them. But I have until 51 to worry about it. Okay. So I'm going to add my goal. For Siam? Yeah, no, for Chiang Mai. Yeah, yeah, for Siam. Okay, okay. It's 13 war score, so we should have plenty of room. Uh, you're almost there anyway. We're at 30 right now. So are you going to get... um. Are you going to build some units in in uh, Johor? Or can you? Uh, no, I cannot. I could probably focus, switch focus to soldiers there instead. Uh, they're, they're actually... Well, yeah, I'll switch there. I just added Burma to my sphere. Oh, good. So now they, now they should let you through. Oh my gosh, I'm 19th most powerful in the world. That'll go up. I mean, we're going to get you pretty strunk. Over I just there. got 10 prestige and I went up 10 spots. So. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I've been just grabbing prestige technologies and coal and steel technology. <laughs> is all I've been grabbing. I probably have enough to grab a war goal. No, I don't. Even I just let Netherlands walk through my country. I don't know if that was good or not. Well, they yeah, they didn't ask me again. Maybe you know, like maybe they'll decide that they have no chance. So yeah, if I could build troops over here in Johor, then I could grab like Ochj, just you know, like free provinces basically for more population. Right. There may be any luxury goods that I may need later on. Exactly. Thirty nine. We're still not going well enough. You're going to have to siege some more stuff over here. Okay. I, uh, is that true, though? Because I added a war goal, and uh, let me see. Will add me, let me add another one. Yeah, it's going to let me add another one if I wanted. What? It might be that you're not doing enough. <laughs> <laughs> you might be the problem in this relationship. <laughs> if we didn't know that from the beginning. Yeah, you could grab a whole bunch of stuff, couldn't you? And you can't, oh, because I don't have, oh, yeah, it's not E4, is it? I'm sure you probably have to get, ooh. Um, I'm just going to take peace. Rumors abound in the botanical circles that the United Kingdom has launched a botanical expedition to Broom. <gasps> How dare should you? I, should I lose prestige or gain prestige? Uh, I don't know. Oh, my God. Look at what happened in uh, in Siam. What? 
Oh, you grabbed me. Oh, oh cool. I, sorry. It turned green and I had a bunch of pop-ups. I thought it gave you um, both. <laughs> I oh. was upset. <laughs> I was upset <laughs> I thought I gave you both of them. I was like, what the hell? So, you know what? I didn't realize until just now. We're Christmas colors. Yeah, we... Re eventually, the whole world. Christmas <laughs> colors. Santa strikes back. Right. Ooh, I just got cheap iron. Do you want to declare on, uh, on Netherlands? Well, no. There's got to be an easier way. This is this string of alliances is BS. Yeah, like, like, they literally are so... They're more overpowered than you are. Yeah, I can't declare war on Spain... Not even, like, for around Gibraltar? No, no, no. I can't declare war on Spain just because they're allied with Austria. Yeah. <laughs> so that would be just pointless. And Russia's... <laughs> Russia's ally... So it's a three-way alliance between Russia, Netherlands, and France. Yeah, they have their little entente. <sighs> there is nothing we can do. Unless we want to do an all-out war against those three already. Uh, no. <laughs> yeah, which is why we're like we're better off going to war with Prussia right now, uh, even yeah. though they have all their states. I mean, they're probably going to be the best. We're we're stuck between a rock and a hard place. Well, you are. I'm just I'm just here. <laughs> yeah. Well, <laughs> I mean, you know. I have nine thousand troops. That's all I got. So what would you take if you were to take... It would probably be the Rhineland. Yeah. Because that's like really good shit over there. Yeah, coal. For freaking Ru Pro Germany. Iron, coal, coal, coal. <laughs> we're, they don't have anything to eat. It's all coal and iron. <laughs> that's what the Rhineland's all about. The water's all black, probably. No, it, it literally is. It's I'm so close stuff. to taking this piece. From Belgium? Yeah. <laughs> but then I'll never be able to walk through you. I'll never be able to walk through you to Prussia. Oh, yeah. If they take the rest of it. All right. Go away, Belgium. <laughs> we are going to be sitting here 50 years in game from now. <laughs> Still waiting for the well, piece out of that. It we finally can... became a good choice to go to war with Netherlands, so... Maybe, <laughs> once that happens. you think that eventually, like, great powers would screw that up enough that they'd break alliances for getting into a war with each other in a crisis? Hmm. Oh, I'm still up to 19. I need more prestige. I should just be going down the prestige check tech line. Hmm. Yeah, that'll get you to be great power really fast. I shouldn't have went, <clears throat> shouldn't have went for uh, engineers. What was I thinking? I don't. Yeah, I mean, anything. either way, it's not really going to matter because you're going to become a great power regardless. And there's no, you don't really need to become a great power. Here we go, Macedonia. All right, I'll let the Dutch through. Spain's in this one. All right, Austria went France. Spain hasn't decided. Prussia hasn't. So Prussia will go. Spain will go France. Prussia will go Ottomans. Ottomans will concede. Hmm. That'll be how that one goes. I'm trying to see if there's anything we can possibly do. That's like the most twisted set of alliances I think I've ever seen in Victoria 2. The Netherlands, France, Russia thing? Yeah. Like it what? knows we're playing together. It's yeah. like, oh, we, we must challenge these players somehow. Anyways, my truce with uh China is gonna be about to be up. Yeah, you, Next you should year. probably extend it. Or just go to go to war again. Yeah, I mean, I'm gonna I'm gonna just go take a province every chance I get, because it's gonna be cheap if I only do one at a time, and if I do that for like the rest of the game, I should be, you know, eating them pretty steadily. Before they westernize. Oh God, the, the dark times. <laughs> yep, Spain went France, which means the Ottomans will concede. 
Okay, who else can I fabricate against for you to fight? Prussia might go to uh, might go to Ottomans, so they might win. Mm. Could really use a war for this. For what? It's all for West Macedonia. Yep, they went Ottomans. Here we go. Fight, 100. fight, fight. Damn it. Ah, oh, damn it. Who acquired that? Greece? Greece did? Yeah, Greece strunk. What? Yeah, we need to... They're remaking an empire. <laughs> They're going to be Byzantium soon. Yeah. Uh, would you be willing to... Oh, would you be willing to go fight or just drop 15,000 troops on Ochje? Yeah, sure. Okay, I'm going to justify. I keep pausing and unpausing. <laughs> With the, the space bar does nothing, though. I was going to say, Ian. Oh, damn it. I lost my prestige in your territory. Hmm? I'll be back. I don't have any industrial power. No. But I'm almost at, I'm at half a million population. Okay. I'm at 80 days until I can go to war with Ochre. <clears throat> I'm losing population. Do you have cholera or anything? I think so. Okay. I got six infamy. Yeah, I have influenza. Till 51. Ooh. Oh, you got six inf How, What's your infamy at right now? 20.3. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah. So I can still, by the time you fight this war for me, uh, well, Siam's basically done. Mm hmm I could grab one of the lower provinces that has tropical wood or something. I don't know. Maybe by then I'll eventually be able to fight my own wars. Is Japan? Oh, they're partially westernized. Korea's still out. Well, they're not in a sphere, but they're allied with China. I have 20 days until I can declare. On Dacha? Okay, cool. Yeah. I got my army sitting out in the boat. Okay. As soon as it goes up, I'll declare. Okay. And that's to uh, protect at them? Yep. Cool. I'll get that whole area. And then, if anything, we go to war with the Dutch, I can grab the rest of that island. Yeah. Okay. Establish protectorate. Calling you in now. Proceed. They have 15,000. Half morale. You can probably see it anyway. Here we come. I'm going to go ahead and build forts on that island. And Ooh, I can, upgrade, I can upgrade your railroads. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> that gold, though, that's going to be really worth a lot. Oh, especially with those think. nice... Oh, no. <laughs> wow, that went great. Yeah, it did. I think that's probably a good place to call it. I think my recording drive is probably full.